the haunting melody in the quiet town of Raven's Hollow, where mist clung to the ancient trees and shadows whispered forgotten tales. There stood an abandoned music box shop named Melodious Echoes, its proprietor, an enigmatic figure known only as the Maestro, had vanished decades ago, leaving behind a collection of eerie, silent music boxes. One stormy night, a curious musician named Clara stumbled upon melodious echoes. Intrigued by the mystery that surrounded the shop, she decided to explore its hidden treasures. As she entered, the door creaked open, welcoming her with an unsettling melody that seemed to emanate from the silence. Rows of dusty music boxes adorn the shelves, each one intricately crafted with scenes of forgotten memories. Clara, drawn to a particular box covered in cobwebs, opened it hesitantly. The haunting melody had escaped sent shivers down her spine. Suddenly, the room transformed. Shadows danced on the walls and the air grew thick with a spectral presence. The music box projected ethereal images of the maestro, lost in a macabre dance with phantoms from a bygone era. Clara, captivated and unnerved, felt as though she had stepped into a realm where time stood still. As the melody played on, Clara realized that the music boxes were more than mere trinkets the were vessels for trapped souls. The maestro, in a desperate attempt to preserve the music of the departed, had unwittingly bound spirits to his creations. Determined to break the spectral chains, Clara sought the help of an elderly historian who knew the secrets of Raven's Hollow. Together, they uncovered the tragic tale of the maestro, a man consumed by the pursuit of an otherworldly symphony. Armed with this knowledge, Clara confronted the music boxes one by one, each encounter releasing trapped souls and intensifying the haunting melody. The room pulsated with the echoes of long-forgotten sorrows as Clara battled the supernatural forces in a climactic moment, the final music box played its haunting melody, resonating with the tormented soul of the maestro. As the last note lingered, the room fell silent, and melodious echoes seemed to exhale a sigh of relief. Clara, surrounded by the fading echoes, emerged from the shop with a heavy heart. Melodious echoes though still and silent, bore the scars of a spectral symphony that had finally found release. End of the haunting melody.